Hi everyone, welcome back to a new series of Rise of Flight. Here we are, 28th of March 1917. It's a new day and a new light and a new career starting for us today. We have joined number 4 squadron, a naval squadron at that in the Royal Flying Corps. Uh, we are located at Cloudekirk Airfield, something like that anyway. Um, and yes, we are in springtime, so let us find out who we'll be following today. Okay, let me introduce you to our protagonist, Alfie West. He's a bit of a scoundrel, by all accounts, and when I say scoundrel, not the kind of um, cheeky chappy um, scoundrel. He's kind of a dark character. Um, Alfie West is wanted under a different name by the Met Police for a double murder of Messrs. Wormsley and uh, Hurt Hartford. Uh, the warrant was issued under his real name, Francis Kenneth Harris, an identity which he left behind uh, along with the murder weapon, a pregnant girlfriend and debts amounting to a sum of £346. A score of convictions for fraud, theft and assault, to say nothing of the venomous hatred of his many victims. So he's not a particularly nice character. So he's joined up the Flying Corps uh, to see if he can uh, A, probably get away from the law, but B, to see if he can... Uh, let's, let's think positively. He, he wants to join up and make some kind of amends for the, uh, the pain you know, that he has suffered for, to others. After completing his training without incident, he was assigned to number four Naval Squadron. He arrived on the continent on the 27th of March 1917. His name appeared on the blackboard for the, the day's mission. Seeing it, he rubbed his hands at the prospect and the whole war was at his feet. I thought I was going to say he rubbed his name off the board. So he didn't want to join. So there he is. There is our protagonist, Alfie West. Now let's check out number four squadron and see what we're doing. So here we are. Number four, naval squadron. Uh, we've got quite a oh, very new squadron as you can see. Brand new formed. And there we are at the bottom, number 17 pilot. So just starting in the lower ranks, but that's fine. Uh, we all start from the same kind of uh, blank sheet. And we'll be flying the Sopwith Pup, one of the uh, Sopwith um, company's first aircraft. Obviously, famously, you know, the Sopwith Camel, which is um, an up step from this one. And then the, the Sopwith Triplane as well. So, yeah, we're going to start off with the Sopwith Pup, which is going to be interesting. Okay, here we are. 28th of March. This morning, there was a balloon attack. Uh, it seemed to go off without any problems. Um... We weren't assigned to it, so that's okay. Now, at 1.18 in the afternoon, there's a line patrol. And we're going up, uh, along with um, Jason Burns as flight lead, Andrew Burton, Peter Wright, Lewis Dawson, and then ourselves, Alfie West. Cool. Okay, here we are. Mission briefing. Uh, the weather, perfect visibility, ideal flying conditions. Fantastic. Wind at ground level, west, southwest, 5 meters per second. Wonderful. But primary objective... Follow your assigned route and patrol the area over our frontline positions. Take off 1318. Good luck and good revs. So, um, do we have anything we can do to our beautiful Sopwith pup? Here it is. Look at this. Oh, I'm looking forward to flying this, actually. Looking forward to it. Um, do we have any number four? We've got number three naval squadron, but we don't have number four, it would seem. Um, oh, we can get some rockets on this bad boy. Look at that. we got rockets. Holy crap, that's going to be fun. They're more like fireworks, but this is going to be great stuff. Um, we've got the convergence at 139 meters. Okay. Okay. AIDS, um, Aldis Refractor type um, site. No, thank you. And a cockpit light. Ooh. Oh, no, we got rockets. High explosive rockets. I thought we could put maybe a Lewis gun on the top, but no. Uh, we'll have green scarf, yes, and green banner should we ever get asked. Um, but no, cool, 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 cool. Right, let's get to the aircraft and uh, get up in the air. Okay, here we are. Let's um, crack the throttle a little bit. Get the the engine started. Oh, wow. Never flown the pup. As I say, we're coming in this as a absolute raw pilot. 
Do a quick control surfaces check. All seems to be good. Flight leads away. Can I have I can hear guns going off. We got bombers above this or something. Alright. Speed in some power. Drop the nose a little bit. Oh, there you go. And we are away, up and away, in the Sopwith Pub. Lovely, right. Cock the gun. No, she she really wants to pull left. Uh, so I'll try and hold that. I did notice, yeah, the the I don't know which way the propeller's rotating. I can look either way. Oh no, she's steadied off now. She's now we got a bit of speed. She's she's um stable, nice and stable. Oh hello. No, that looks like an FE2B. That looks fine. And there are um, flight over there, so I think we're okay. I don't know what these guns are going off for. I... That's an FE2B. Yeah, that's a British bomber or observation aircraft, so I'm not worried about that. Um, so we're going to try and close up on our boys over here. They seem to be getting away from us. And. Uh, We'll start our uh, patrol over to the front line to see um, if we can find anything and shoot anything down and get any victories on our first time. Now, I'm wondering the the, uh, the rockets we've got are they? I'm guessing they're for balloons. I'm guessing they're for a balloon attack. The way they're angled and everything. Well, I guess you could do you know strafing ground targets, but yeah. Anyway. We'll see what um, comes along. But for now, let's uh, continue flying on. Hi everyone, our, our flight is just split. What? Oh, hang on. What's happening? We got an enemy in it within our midst. Why are they all going home? What have I missed? We've all turned around. We're heading back to base. There's flak in the air. Okay, there's got to be an enemy aircraft. Where is it? Oh, is that an enemy enemy observation bomber aircraft up there? Okay. Oh, it's turning. Let's have a look. I have just noticed that none of my other um, members of the flight have rockets on their wings, so um, I may have just strapped them to the wings for no apparent reason. But if you can go to go to war with or without rockets, why would you go without? I mean, <laughs> okay, this. He definitely seems to be going for this aircraft, okay. So, he's going away from us though. Let's just see if he's, he hasn't got an escort. I'm surprised if he ventured out here all on his lonesome. Yeah, the 
one thing you note with the Assault with Pup, it's not the quickest aircraft in the world. Here he comes. Get him. Nope. Nope. I'm so, so I'm really worried about the other. Um, squadron uh, flyers. I'm worried that we're going to actually come to grief by um, clipping them. Oh, wings are fluttering. Oh no, that's that's. A... Oh, I think two of our buddies have just hit each other. been a collision anyway. This is the danger. Sh shoulder shooting and everyone getting a bit too excited. Or maybe they just got it wrong and... Oh, he's burning away. That's probably a death right there. Very lucky to have got away from that one. Okay, well, this is a good first um, try out for the Salt with Pub. It's actually quite a stable aircraft. It's not too much bother. Oh, hang on. Watch out. Alright, someone under my wing. Oh, no. It's a friendly. Ooh. Good job of my shooting's off. There we go. That's the other one. Alright, now we're on him. Well, actually, it might have only just been one pup which has gone down. Characteristic. Tempted to fire the rockets. Oh god. <laughs> There's aircraft all over us. Right, let's just get a bit of um, breathing space. Wow, that was close to us, wasn't it? I felt the uh, aircraft rock a little bit for that. Right, where is he? Really making a meal of this as a flight.
Well, first kill for the squadron. Um, first loss for the squadron as well. Ooh, we need to improve on that. Right, let's start heading towards our actual um, patrol route now. And uh, see what ammo and stuff we've got left when we get there. Right, we'll continue on. Hi everyone, welcome back. Right, we're just um, coming over to the coast. Uh, this is the town of Newport. Not Newport, South Wales, but Newport. Um, I think down here. Back down that way. Can't quite make it out, it's Dunkirk. Um, but you can see our buddies are just flying over the, um, over the coastline for the moment. And we're coming over the front lines. Look at this. So the front lines down here going all the way to the sea. So we're coming over the front line now, we've got a British observation balloon there. Give them a little salute. And there's a, oh, there's a, there's a, oh, there's a couple of non-friendly observation balloons. A little bit low, maybe, the flap seems to be quite heavy. I'm side slipping down there because I don't want to overspeed. Maybe these. Um, I'm. Oh Christ! Yeah, the guns are ready. There's a lot of flight around here. I'm looking at these rockets, thinking there are probably a one fire t only. As in, I press fire and all eight rockets will uh, launch at once, rather than being able to fire them. Yeah, the the, the uh, anti-aircraft fire, the ACAC around here is is really quite hot. I'm not going to go down to those. I think that'll be suicide. Yeah, look at it. Look at it. That's um, that was a bad move. Dropping down. Let's get out of here. Oh my god, this is red. We're just taking a couple of strikes of. Um, it wasn't a flat gut. Um. Small arms fire, we just took a bit of a strike from. Are they are, buddy? I think. Oh, God, this is. Anti aircraft fire around here is so hot. I've lost the, uh, the rest of the flight since I've been dodging and diving. Um, I might just come over to friendly territory just to try and get away from some of this ack ack. Okay, I've just seen a um, barrage balloon. They're bringing it down as quickly as possible. We're trying to get it. We're away from the heavy flak over there. if we can launch these rockets. I'm not sure what the, the key is. Oh, we missed! <laughs> that was rubbish. Okay, they, they fire. I thought they were going to go straight down. We can see the rocket hits down there. Adding to the um, uh, they were a one fire trick. I thought they would be, and that was woeful. Okay, I didn't give myself enough approach time, but. Okay, 
she's down, but we don't seem to be getting any ground fire, so we'll uh, we'll come into Strafer. Look at this real horrible look. look. It's so wet. It's so so wet. There are lakes and uh, I bet this is these trenches. I bet they're flooded. Right, at least that's something we've got to our name. We've got a balloon kill. We're off the mark, which is the important thing. Although there was no one here to witness it. So we can pretend our rockets struck home. Yeah. Okay, I think a number of reasons that rocket attack didn't go one. well. One, I didn't set up properly. Two, the button I thought was going to be the rocket attack wasn't the rocket attack, it was another one. So I... After I pressed the two most likely buttons I thought were going to be the attack, um, I then started randomly pressing the other buttons, and um, yeah, so I wasn't really watching where I was aiming. Lesson learned. Let's, um, I think, that's probably for our first patrol. Enough excitement. We'll, uh, we'll start heading, we'll head down the end of the uh, the patrol route and see if we spot anything else. Any, any enemy aircraft. If not, I think... Uh, we'll perhaps start making our way home. Quick check. Uh, the windsock is uh, indicating that we need to land towards the hangars. So we'll make our approach now. We've lost enough height. Coming around these trees and see how easy it is to land the uh, softwood pop. Probably a little bit higher than I wanted to so need a bit of bit of the engine a bit. Oh, she's, she's got quite a bit of lift. She's just sort of hanging there. Get down. Oh, there we go. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right, let's get the tail in. Oh, and skid. Don't slide. Don't slide. Don't slide. Put the tail in. There we go. Held it. Oh, and welcome back to home base. Oh, just switch the engine off. Wonderful. Right. Let's get into debriefing and uh, get a cup of tea. Okay, here we are. Mission debriefing. V4 victory. Primary objective was completed. We completed the patrol. Mission time, 51 minutes and 8 seconds. Alfie West landed and was awarded a balloon kill. Hurrah. Um, sadly, flight leader Jason Burns was the one we saw get into a bit of a pickle. Not sure what happened. He crashed and sadly he perished in that crash. Andrew Burton... One of our flight buddies, he was the one who was credited with the uh, German aircraft kill. So congratulations, Andrew. Goes to the top of the pops. and uh, But we obviously got some reward for taking out the observation balloon as well. Everyone else was um, still airborne, which is good. So it was, it was, I originally thought there was two aircraft tangling. It appears that it was just Jason getting into trouble on his own. Uh, we have been awarded the Crocs de Guerre, the War Cross. Wonderful. First medal. Lovely. And obviously, just confirmation that we lost flight lead Jason Burns in that encounter. Andrew Burton, 
shot down Helmut Albrecht in his Albatross D2. Nice. That's a good kill. That was a good kill. And obviously we lost um, Jason Burns. Quick look in the squadron. After, um, I was going to say after one round, but no, Andrew Burton has got two aircraft kills. He's been he's been on, blimey, he's would be on two sorties now. Um, and he's got a kill in each of his sorties and a balloon kill. Wow, he is he is the uh, the star of the the squadron so far. It would seem no one else has got an aircraft kill. Um, only one other has a balloon kill, and that'll be our own Alfie West, the scoundrel that is. Yeah, uh, one mission complete, one mission successful, which is good. Um, and we are 673rd already on the all-time uh, players list for the squadron. Uh, we have one stop with Camel. No, it's not Camel. It's a pup, which um, requires a day's work. We've got 15 fully um, airworthy pups to go. Uh, looking at our personal room, obviously... 34,177th in the all-time players ranking. We've got our war cross, uh, and we've got our um, our one kill, our balloon kill, which is good. It's a start for this scoundrel, making amends for his uh, previous life of uh, uh, crime and um, and awfulness. But um, yes, we're going to go again. Alfie West completes his first mission. Can he continue to uh, make amends for his ill? crimes in the past um, join us next time when we go up again and see what faces alfie west take care i'll see you next time bye bye